I'm Patty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw a Valentine's truck. I'm going to take two fingers over here on the left in the center and put a dot. And from that dot, I'm going to draw a straight line over, a straight diagonal up, straight line over, straight line down, big straight line, and leave it floating. I come back to the left, I'm going to draw a straight line down, curve line over, big straight line, curve line over, straight line, straight line up, connect. I come back over here to the left. I draw a curved line down and little straight lines inside. I come up to the top and I draw a curved line, connect. I come back over here on the left and I draw a big curved line over, down and connect. I come over here on the right and draw another big curve line down, over, connect. Right here at the end I draw a little straight line, straight line, straight line, connect, rectangle. Come back to the left. I'm going to draw a big curve line up, over, connect on the left, big curve line up, over, connect on the right. I'm going to come back in and draw a baby circle on the left, baby cir or curve line on the right. Come up to the top and we're going to mimic this line. Straight line, straight line, straight line, straight diagonal up, connect, straight line down, connect, baby rectangle, straight line, straight line, straight line, connect. Okay. We're going to draw a slightly wavy line, jump over, jump over, jump over. We want our wheels to look like they're moving, so we put two little animation curved lines, curved lines. Okay, now come back up here to the top. We're going to do some overlaps. Curve line in, curve line out, connect. Curve line in, 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 out, connect. Now we're all going to end up with a different amount because we all draw differently. Now come up and just do curve line, curve line, connect. 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 Now I want my hearts to look like they're flying off the truck. So I'm just going to go curve line, curve line, connect. Bring it up, curve line, curve line, connect to show movement. Keep going, curve line, curve line, connect. Let's do one more here. Curve line, curve line, connect. Okay, I think that's all. Let's see how we're going to color this in. Okay, this project is totally for fun. So you can color your truck any way you want. But I start off and I do black wheels, and you'll do a better job coloring than me. And this is a black wheel. Again, you'll do a better job than me. Now, I went ahead and took my yellow and I did my headlight, my grill, my window, my door handle, my hubcaps, all yellow, and my little exhaust. Okay? Like I said, you can do these any color you want. Next, I got my red out and I did a red truck. You could do a purple truck. You could do a violet truck. You can do your truck any color you want. 
this is the color I chose. You're the artist. You can choose your own. And keep going, keep going. Do a better job than me. Keep going, keep going. So there's your truck. Now, what I ended up doing for my Valentine hearts. I did pink. And I did red violet. And you can do it in a pattern. You can do it any which way you want. You can do multi-colors. This is what I chose. Once again, you are the artist. You can make your own choices. I thought red violet was a nice touch though because we never get the opportunity to use that enough. Okay? Everybody's going to have a different amount. Of Valentine's flying all over the place and that is fine okay now the last thing I did I took my red violet and I just drew straight lines going across the bottom and then I came in with my pink and did that in between just to give another add a little add of color all right let's see what this looks like all colored in Okay, here is my Valentine truck all colored in. Remember, sometimes you can do art just for fun. Okay, bye-bye.